Well, smelly, filthy, and in some cases, soggy heaps of trash, ideal conditions for attracting mosquitoes, mice, and rats. And it's all from an alleged illegal dumping on the property of a North Tulsa business. Two Works For You problem solver Sharon Phillips shows us the problem and the solution to getting things cleaned up. Sharon. Hey, Mike, you know, I can tell you when we drove up out here, it's extremely shocking to see. Take a look here behind me. This is what you see when you drive up on the property of the Family Dollar Store near the corner of 56th Street North and Peoria. Now, the site is just outside the Tulsa city limits, so the city really couldn't do anything about the complaints it received about all of this mess. That added to the frustration of neighbors fed up with heaping bags of garbage dumped along the road leading to the store. The mess scattered and spilling out on the ground along with the trash, old broken mattresses and furniture. Then there's the smell. For about the last year or so, we have had some on and off again issues with illegal dumping going on at the Family Dollar uh, near 56th Street North in Peoria. Adam Austin is with the Tulsa City County Health Department. The site is within its jurisdiction and it gets lots of complaints about the mess. Austin says this time when it didn't get cleaned up. March 16th, we actually sent a, a notice of violation to the owner and posted a copy on the property itself. That notice not far from the store's own no dumping sign. The notice gave the family dollar store 10 business days to get rid of the garbage. When that didn't happen, the inspector went back up to the property and the situation had probably gotten actually a little bit worse. And uh, we actually hand delivered a warning citation to the manager on duty. We reached out to Family Dollar's corporate office about the mess and that citation. In a statement, it said we are aware of the recent report and are committed to ensuring our store adheres to all local regulations and company standards. Our store's team and their business partners have a heightened sense of urgency and are in the process of addressing the issue. To ensure the area is cleaned up, THD is also working with Oklahoma's Department of Environmental Quality. It's become such a nuisance for the neighbors that, you know, multiple agencies have had to get involved. And property owners are responsible for getting rid of the trash, even if it was illegally dumped. Now, if they don't, the Tulsa Health Department can hire a contractor to clean it all up, then put a lien against the property to get it reimbursed. For more information about how to report illegal dump sites that need cleaning up, you can just head over to our website, kjrh.com. Sharon Phillips, Two Works For You Problem Solvers.